that C6 warmed up a little bit. There's a Subaru uh, SUV and two boomers right on my ass, so I had to let them know, you know. I was going slow for a reason. Stay away. What's going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Good to see you today. Uh, I figured we'd go out and do a, drive the C6 a little bit more. I uh, was working at my house in the garage today on a, a little project. I had to reattach some leather strip to the bottom of the drawer, door. And I had my lady out there with me kind of uh, chit-chatting about just you know, the rest of the day and whatnot. And she noticed how nice it was. I said, hey, are you going to drive your Corvette today? I said, you know I'm going to. So here we are. Uh, just got it warmed up. I was sitting in the garage for about 10, 15 minutes. We're, right at the right temperature now to kind of to get on it a little bit so we're going to do some of my favorite sunday driving activities which is we're going to jump on the highway here in a second we're going to do uh some some proper c5 holes so if you guys are down for that let's go I hope everybody's having a, a good Sunday. So it's uh, for me, it's been a pretty good Sunday. I went to the store earlier. My kids are both with us today. Uh, just you know, enjoying some family time when it's all said and done is, is always kind of nice. But our son's sleeping right now. My daughter's playing video games with uh, with my lady. So uh, I decided, you know, they're not going to interact with me right now. And I guess the the project's done around the house that I wanted to uh, to accomplish so far this weekend. Then I might as well have the. Uh, the enjoyment of a little bit of me time so yeah that's something that's, that i always make sure that i get enough of maybe it's selfish maybe it's not but to me it's therapeutic to get that me time this is one of my uh my favorite forms of, of therapy and that's uh going out and kind of just rowing the gears on a manual v8 with traction control off on a sunday um, so it's a fun car i uh, i really enjoy driving I won't be too uh, too rowdy. Like I said, I haven't even broke the speed limit yet on purpose. So, not not trying to uh, to speed, but just try to enjoy uh, just trying to enjoy the C6 Corvette for what it is. I think this pickup truck wants to wants to pull. He's sitting next to me like he's a hard ass. So, definitely has uh, some nice wheels and tires on that thing, but. You know, I don't, I don't know if I'd uh, invest my, my money in wheels and tires on a, a pickup truck that's uh, ridden with rust, but, you know, hey, that's just me, so. We're about to jump on the highway here in just a second, and uh, we'll do a few a few highway pulls, so. One of my favorite parts is coming up right here. As soon as we get through this light, we're gonna, we're gonna jump on the highway. Well, the truck's trying to, trying to flex on me with this exhaust. You guys see what I see up there? I see a Mustang and a Miata in front of my way, right in front of them. So, I'm going with this little palace, palace state, is that this Hyundai, 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 however you say it. I know uh, my dad says it one way, but he says diabetes as well as I say diabetes. Diabetes, so, but I'm gonna catch up to that Mustang real quick, so let's go.
second. It's and the reason I say it's better is because it's uh, the way the way you get on that the, the on ramp there. It's it's just a lot more fun than what that is. Um, yeah, we'll, we'll go here in just a second. some more poles and maybe we'll get lucky and we'll come across the another mustang or something that's uh faster than a, a mustang out there you know it's, i like to see how fast their cars are like i said it's if that was a, a seventy thousand dollar mustang or eighty thousand dollar mustang i saved 60 grand and, and yeah it, John, it got on me but i didn't downshift i don't run like that i was just sitting in fourth and just hit it i didn't i didn't downshift the third or second or anything like that um which i probably should have and then i know i would have got a lot more torque and a lot more power but in the same sense like i said i just do poles i don't necessarily do uh racing so it's not really my thing i was just happy to get lucky right there and uh and bump into that mustang so this is fantastic there's a semi on the side of the road here which means i guess still i'll get on but not as uh at the pace i'd like to so it is what it is though you always got to be careful and mindful of other drivers in the road and realize you're not the only car out there so these guys should really got me pretty good Oh, the semi decides to move now.
sorry for the, the sigh right there. You probably feel my pain. Uh, just, just nonsense of what I'm dealing with in front of me. We've got a semi and a pickup truck going 61 miles an hour right now. We've got plane. This is phenomenal. Come on, guys. Can somebody please go 62 and a half and pass the other one. I don't even care about the stupid focus in front of me. I was going to get out of the way. There we go. Now maybe the focus will get out of the way too.
hit subscribe, leave me a comment, like I said, and let me know uh, what you think about about those bus things, how much does something like that cost? I really don't know, so um, I, I guess I could just Google it too, but you know, it's always good to do some community engagement for our team. But until I see you guys again, drive safe, enjoy your Corvettes, enjoy your Mustangs, enjoy whatever it is you guys. Just be safe and doing it. Talk soon. See, I thought it had something like that. But if I had a Ford Raptor and have my kids with me and something like this real quick, today it'd be hard not to be an idiot. So I'm glad I don't have a Ford Raptor for that reason. This is only a two seater. Can't do anything too stupid. I mean, I can. I can still be real stupid in it. But if I had that Raptor, I'd be stupid on the daily because that'd be my daily. I also, my Raptor or a Raptor would cost more than my entire fleet cost. So I could, I could get the value of four cars. It, instead of just having one pickup truck so for me it's almost a no-brainer because i still have my pickup truck i have my wagon too that i can haul the family in, and then i have the corvette which i really enjoy damn it there's the mustang gt of course right now is when i see a mustang gt now we're on the highway right now Exact reason right there. That Raptor, love to have it. Can't do it with the wife and kids though.